What's up you guys, Victor Lopez here. and Today I'm gonna to show you the most important part of painting. And that is the art of cutting in along your edges. Now, hands down, no matter what, I have to say the most important part is cutting in because when people walk into a room, they can see your edges along door frames, baseboards, and the ceiling. And that's why I believe that single-handedly this is the most important part of painting, period. With that being said, I'm gonna demonstrate that on this wall right here. Watch out now. The first thing you're gonna want, first of all, is to get yourself a good quality brush. I myself like to use Wooster or Purdy. I don't waste my time buying stuff at Walmart, like the good, better, best. Same thing that they have at Home Depot. That it's just, for me, it's a crappy selection and it doesn't spread paint as well as these, uh, these quality brushes will. They cost more, obviously, but way worth it, okay? So what I'm showing you right now is absolutely nothing. Just how well <laughs> this brush spreads paint, all right? Why you wanna spend money on a quality brush. All right, now let's go ahead and get into cutting in. Now what you don't want to do, which is the wrong way, is loading your paintbrush with all of this paint, right? And then pretending like you're gonna get a good line. Check it out. You notice how the paint rolled over right here and right there, right? If you look right in here, we have some paint on the door frame. Now that I've pretty much worked out all the paint out of here. Now see right there how I was able to just smooth out that paint very well. That's actually why you want to get a Purdy or a Wooster, like the quality brushes, because what it is is that it spreads the paint further, much better, okay? Now, the best way to do this when you're going to cut in, I'm gonna get a bit of a shaky cam here, and I'm sorry, guys. Best way to cut in, get the paint on the brush, okay? And then you're gonna knock off that bump. You see the bump on the tip? Let me turn off this focus lock. You're gonna wanna knock off the bump on the tip of that, like just get that off. See how much is on there? Get that off, okay. And then I like to use my pinky as a guide. And I just installed these, so bear with me. Press your brush here, and I'm struggling holding a camera and painting. Push it, get your brush on there. You don't need to get on the door right away. And then just come down. Wow, I'm actually surprised I was able to do that holding the camera. <laughs> but you'll notice there's actually no paint on the door frame. Here we go, because I came, came in right there along the door frame and then I started to come out before I ran out. Versus down here, we actually have paint on the door frame because we couldn't control it doing this number, right? That is the single most important thing. When you're using an angle brush, you don't use it like this. You use it like this, okay? Once you've gotten your paint where you want it, like once you've done your edge, then you can come in and go ahead and spread the love because now you're creating an area to work with when you start rolling versus you trying to get your roller as close to the door frame as possible, all right? Now, I know it's not my usual style video, but I figured I'd go ahead and share that with you guys right now while I was in the process of painting my bathroom. Hands down, the most important thing is cutting in along the edge. When someone walks into the house, that is pretty much what they're gonna see. They're gonna see that paint along the door frame, they're gonna see that paint along the baseboards and along the ceiling. So if you're not gonna be using tape, and even if you are using tape to cover your edges, make sure to do that very minor technique that I just showed you. It's gonna go a long way. It's gonna give you that professional look that you're looking for in your house. Watch out now. Hope you enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Catch you on the next one. Oh, my wife is gonna kill me. <laughs> okay. Hey everyone, Victor Lopez here. and Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm gonna to teach you the most important part of painting, period. Cutting in. 
cutting in. Very stupid intro.